Hi, I'm John. We created Cruises with Friends to help you coordinate your sailings with the people you know. If you're a fan of Royal Caribbean and the thrilling experience of the Flow Rider, you might be wondering which ships boast this state-of-the-art surfing simulator. Introduced in 2006, the Flow Rider has become one of Royal Caribbean's signature amenities. You can find the Flow Rider on multiple classes of ships within the Royal Caribbean fleet. So let's delve into the details. When Voyage Through the Seas was launched in 1998, it did not have a flow rider, nor did any of the other ships in the Voyager class. Following refurbishments and renovations, all of the ships in the Voyager class now support flow riders. They are Adventure of the Seas, Explorer of the Seas, Mariner of the Seas, Navigator of the Seas, and of course, Voyager of the Seas. When Freedom of the Seas was launched in 2006, it was the first ship to ever have a flow rider. And all of the ships in the Freedom class have flow riders, and they are Freedom of the Seas, Independence of the Seas, and of course Liberty of the Seas. Next up are the Quantum class ships, all of which have flow riders, and they are Anthem of the Seas, Odyssey of the Seas, Ovation of the Seas, Quantum of the Seas, and Spectrum of the Seas. The Oasis class ships were the first ships to introduce two flow riders, and they are Allure of the Seas, Harmony of the Seas, Oasis of the Seas, and Symphony of the Seas. Unfortunately, Wonder of the Seas and Utopia of the Seas only have a single flow rider. And we finish off with the Icon class. Both Icon of the Seas and Star of the Seas have a single flow rider. If you haven't already done so, why not check out the Cruises with Friends website and smartphone apps? Cruises with Friends is a service that we developed to allow us to connect with friends and share which sailings we are on. We hope you enjoyed this video and found it useful. If you did, please click the like button and subscribe to our channel.